How funny seeing you here, at the club, Dr. Bookheim. I'm just, uh, visiting one of my grandchildren. He's a bartender. Oh, um, I'm just here checking up on a patient. Speaking of checking up, how is your joint pain? As a matter of fact, my joint pain has decreased a lot, although I did experience small side effects from the cream, like a mild burning sensation when I first applied the cream. However, the pros outweighed the cons because now I am able to be more active with my children, and grandchildren, and great-grandchildren. In fact, I'm about to have my sixth great-grandchild. I've also discovered, through a fluke, that applying the capsaicin cream to my forehead when I have a headache decreases my head pain. Isn't that fascinating? Yes, actually, another use for the topical cream I recommended is as a headache pain reliever. Capsaicin can work in many different ways. Why yes, it seems like a very versatile and useful substance. Next thing you know, it will cure cancer. You are closer to the truth than you may know. In a recent clinical trial, capsaicin pellets reduced the size of tumors in prostate cancer patients to one-fifth of their original size. And in regards to breast cancer, Scientists conducted an experiment on the effects of capsaicin in the breast cancer cells of mice. The outcome was a fourfold increase in the death of cancer cells, called apoptosis, and a drastic decrease in the rate of cancer cell production. Production slowed by half. Wow! Seems like capsaicin can cure a lot of problems. I'd love to see where this technology will take us in the future. Well, I've got to go now. I'm late for the family reunion. Thanks for your help, Doctor. It was nice seeing you here, to check up on you. I'll see you at your next appointment. Goodbye until then.